Hello. <laughs> How are you? Hello. Good evening. So far, so good. Time. No. Okay. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much. Hi, everybody. On time. Have a good night, everybody. Thank you, thank you for being here. We're going to continue working on section number five, going places. Thank you so much uh, for being here. I wish you the best, and I hope everybody is okay at home and healthy and happy. Some of you are working, as I may see, right? But sorry for you. It's not your case. I'm sorry for you, right? At the end, you will get a bunch of money. That's, that will be your reward, yeah? Bunch of money. Okay, thank you so much for being here. Let's begin with uh, what's going to be the content for today. We will continue working with section number five, as you may see. We have this thing that is future versus going to. So we're dealing with this thing um, in, in, in section number five. Remember that you have a final exam, I guess, in this section, so don't forget to need to do it. Uh, and we're going to have a little bit of practice on uh, this thing that we've been working so far with. The future. The, the future. Okay, so um, thank you so much for being here. Let's, let's begin, people. Uh, you ready? Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Thank you so much. Um, thank you so much. Good evening. Nice to have you. Oh, yes, and we're finished tomorrow. We're done with this one. Okay, so you finish this module, which is uh, in today's going to be the one. last class. Oh, that's going to be tomorrow. Tomorrow, oh, yeah. yeah, I know. Oh, tomorrow's going to be tomorrow's going to be the last class, exactly. Exactly. Uh, no, we're going to the camera. We're going to the camera, so you will get there. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, we're not we're not like kidding. When it, when it comes to parties, or like we're not kidding. We're going places, right? That's that's the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you so much for being here. Okay. Thank, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. It's nice to have you one more time, and I hope you get at home. We're gonna carry on as you may see. We have future with going to and will. Just for you, remember this is the grammar part, as you may see. Uh, and if you notice here, yesterday we were working a little bit of this expression that we use with the future will, right? So that makes easier for you to get when do you gonna use that one. We're gonna ask Delmi. Hello, Delmi Amaya. Good evening. Nice to have you. Welcome, welcome. You participate today? You participate right now? Yes, right now? It's not, we're gonna work with Nelson. Sit on. Hello, Nelson. Good evening, how are you? You good? Yes? Okay, let's work with Mirna. Hello, Mirna. Mirna Landos. How are you, Mirna? Hello, hello, Mirna. You, okay, she has a problem with her mic, I guess. Uh, oh, Nelson, Nelson, can you speak? Can you speak? Uh, no, you, you don't have. Oh, okay. Thank you so much for letting me know. Thank you so much for letting me know, uh, Jose. Uh, oh, okay. Thank you, Nelson, for letting me know. I, I will take it into account. Patricia Castellanos, hello. Good evening. Hello. Patricia. Thank Hello, you, good evening. Thank you. Read the information, please. Thank you. Me? Yes, you. Okay. Future with be going to and will. Use be going to plus verb for plans you decided on. What are you going to do? I'm going to relax at the beach. We're going to go surfing every day. I'm not going to do anything special. 
Use will plus verb for possible plans before you've made a decision. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll just stay at home. Stay home. Let me see. Um, stay home. Maybe I'll take a course. I don't know. I'll. I think I'll go camping. I probably won't go anywhere. Thank you so much, very good. So pretty much, this is the thing we've been working so far. Right? Yes. Uh, when you plan something, you're gonna use going to. Uh, when you have like a decision, right? Really quick decision, yes. Uh, you go with the future with going to, okay? So that's, that's um, and another thing that is quite important is don't forget that when we have this future with will, we have this words or vocabulary, like maybe, probably, I don't know, I'm not sure, yes. So that gives you all oh, this when I, I got to use, right? We're going to have this grammar structure, as you may remember, with will. Uh, we have contraction, right, that we can use. And also with the negative, we can use want, if we want to. And then the best form of the verb, be, we, it, come, et cetera. And then with questions, we have the auxiliary will at the beginning, then a, su a, a subject, and then a verb in infinity form. So pretty much it's not a big deal, I guess, but uh, it, it's important for you to remember how this thing goes. All right. Um, let me see what else do we have. Oh, we have this beautiful picture, okay? Thank you. Where is Alexis? Hello, Alexis. Do me a favor, Ronald. Read, like, describe, describe the, the pictures, please. Thank you. Sure, T-shirt. Nice hair, for T-shirt. You look great. Oh, that's very kind of you. Thank you so much. I appreciate okay. that. Nice. Okay, I think uh, they are a family. And the first picture, they uh, uh they have a great time. Uh, I, I think it's a birthday celebration. And the second, probably the family going to take uh, vacations. And the uh, third picture, the girl uh, going to university. And the final picture, the boy uh, going to buy a car. That was very nice. Thank you so much. Very good. Let's see, Sandra. Hello, Sandra. Thank you, Elizabeth. Tell me out. I have a reading. Uh, I need you to read, please. Thank Happy you so much. Happy New Year. It's December 31st. New Year's Eve, Ruth and Larry Carter are celebrating celebrating the holiday with their children. Nicole and Jonathan, the Carters are very happy family this New Year's Eve. Next year is going to be a very good year for the entire family. Next year, Ruth and Larry are going to take a long vacation. They're going to be see Larry, Larry's brother in Alaska. Nicole is going to finish high school. She's going to move to San Francisco and begin college. Jonathan is going to get this driver license. He's going to save a lot of money and buy and use a car. As June can see, the Carters are really looking forward to next year. It's going to be a very happy year for all of them. Happy New Year. Very good. So Alexis, you got a few of them, right? If you notice, yeah, like right, the girl was going to college and also uh, the guy um, is, is going to buy a, a, a car, right? So that was very close. That was very close. Just, just the celebration is quite different, right? Because you mentioned a birthday party or a birthday. Uh, but here we have like um, a holiday celebration, right? So, and, and also, as you may okay. see here, we're, we're working with, with plants. As you may know, as family, right? Each year, I think um, 
we think about the future that like everything is going to be amazing, right? So we plan things that we want to uh, achieve. Yes, and we use going to uh, when it comes. I'm sorry. Give me... Yes, I'm sorry. And, and we use going to uh, when we want to talk about them, right? That we are going to uh, like do this next next year. So here the, the cutters, that's what they're doing, right? They're like uh, like planning the stuff they're going to do based on the way they live. Okay. Oh, give me a minute, please. I'm sorry. Oh, what is that thing? I mean, here we go. We're gonna have like uh, short dialogues so we can get more uh, examples about how do we can use the future. Uh, simple future tense. We have will and want plus verb plus will s t. Okay. We have dialogue number one. We have Story and calm. Okay. You see the scenario here? We have it at work. So this scenario is happening over there. We're going to have Sarai and Patricia Garcia. Sarai, you are a story and calm. That's going to be you, Patricia. Ready? Okay. Yes, it's. Um, it's Friday. What are you going to do this weekend? A friend is going to visit me. I think we we will have dinner together. Sarai, excuse me. Hello, Sarai. I think, I think we lost her, right? I think we lost Sarai. Okay, because we Yes, I think she got some problems with the internet connection. She was speaking and suddenly she's gone. Okay, I don't, I don't see her here. Hello. Sarai? Hello? Sorry, teacher. Internet connection, no problem, okay? I will pick another one, okay, because of the time. Okay. Um the Laura. We have Laura here. Laura. No? We don't have Laura here. Okay. Let's see. Okay, Milagro de la Paz, thank you. Uh, and, and one more yes, time, sir. you are uh, Patricia Esmeralda, please. So Milagro, you are sorry and calm, that's you, Patricia, sorry. Okay, it's Friday. What are you going to do this weekend? A friend is going to be sitting me. I think we will have dinner together. Nice, would you go to that Italian restaurant? No, we won't. She doesn't like Italian food. Thank you so much, the two of you. Okay, so this is quite simple, right? A short dialogue where we are able to use uh, the two, future with going to and future with will. Also, if you notice here at the end, we included the simple present. So uh, as you may know, when we speak, when we have a general conversation about things, here is where we combine all those tenses together. Yeah, to communicate a message, right? To be clear with the stuff. Yeah. So uh all those tenses that um you've been learning so far, you gotta use them here, right? When you speak like a like a typical conversation. Here we have the scenario at work. So you can have this 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 conversation about oh, what are you going to do this week? Thank you. We're gonna have this dialogue number two, which is about after class. Okay, here we're gonna have Geraldine and um let me see Anna Beatriz. Okay, so Geraldine, you are going to be Pin and Brandon that is going to be you, Anna Beatriz. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, teacher. That unit is so difficult. The text is tomorrow. I think I'm a tro in a trouble. Uh, don't worry, I will help you. Thank you so much. No problem. I will meet you at the library. Thank you so much, right? Very good. Yes. What is one characteristic that we have here in this dialogue number two, Camilo? Pardon me? Yeah, something that you notice that is a characteristic for you to identify. What is the future we're going to use? Tell me, what is that, please? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> really don't know. Oh, okay, no problem. Thank you, Juan David. Okay. What is, yes, what, teacher. Is, what is one thing that you notice in this dialogue that is telling you which future or a future grammar structure you will use? You will use going to or you will use will? Which characteristic gives you like the key to identify the grammar test you are going to use here? Yes. Uh, um... In this in this uh, conversation is uh will is is probably uh, mm -hmm. I don't know is 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 real is 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 um he, the two co-worker uh meet a uh, after in the the class um but uh, you meet is is. No es seguro, no es segura, es es una es 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 un probability. Okay, that's very good. That's very good. Okay, thank you. Uh, uh Ronald, do you have a comment? Thank you. Go ahead. Um, no teacher, but uh, can you repeat the 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 question, please? Oh sure, like based on the on the context of this dialogue, what gives you the key to understand it and to say, oh, this grammar structure with will I'm going to use when it comes to communicate this information. Okay, this one is for sure. And the first phrase. Like, like, for example, oh. I have two options, right, with future, with going to, that is one, and the other one is will. But here, if you notice, in the dialogue, I'm using just will. Tell me why. <clears throat> okay, tell me why. I think uh, this is not a probably, uh, it's a fact, because a uh, thing wants to, to, to help Brandon, but um, honestly, I, I, I miss in, 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 this, in this context. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Thank you. Uh, that is... Like I would like to, to let you know like like the two let's say main purposes of using the future. The first one is we have two options, right? Going to and um future with will, right? And as excuse you may me. know, in basic, in basic, excuse me, one, go ahead. Excuse me, teacher. Entonces, esta prácticamente vendría siendo como ese tipo de conversaciones que uno tiene como con aquellos amigos que como que no quiere reunirse y sí, alguna vez tendríamos que alguna vez tendríamos que tomar el té o alguna vez tendríamos que tomar café. Sí, va, algún algún día. Eso es bueno, eso es la idea. Nothing, nothing like that. Okay, nothing related with that. Absolutely not. No, that's far away. <laughs> no, no, it's, I mean, it's not like no, no, not not related to that. Okay, absolutely not. <laughs> That's something else. That's something else. Okay. Well, I, I remember, teacher, that uh, yesterday we saw something in 
grammar that says um, that you have will when you decided something in the near future. It, there you go. There you go. Okay. There you go. As you may know, in basic, in basic, you remember basic, right? We were working with going to and a little bit of will. In basic, they teach you like, oh, going to is for plans and uh, will is for a probability, right? 50 and 50. But in here, because this is like intermediate one, so here we are focusing on that thing that Patricia is saying. We have the first one, going to is with plans, ready done. But here in this scenario, in this dialogue, is about a decision making, right? You are talking with somebody and you are like, you know, taking decisions, right? Like, uh, oh, the exam is difficult. Okay. Oh, when don't worry, I will help you. Yes. When you are not sure. Um. Yeah, and I mean, it's a decision, right? It's a quick decision. You're, you're like speaking with somebody and you are like say the, the, um, the, the decision like at the moment. You, you didn't Sometimes. plan, you didn't plan the decision. That's why we're gonna use will, because it's a decision taken at, at the time of the speaking, okay? Thank you so much, Patricia. That was that was great. And then we're gonna have the la dialogue number three, okay? Here we're gonna have Camilo. You're gonna be uh, Romy, Camilo, and your partner is going to be, uh, let me see, Geraldine. Please, Geraldine, you are going to be Caitlin. I want to be Romy, will you help me get the door? I am working on something. Sure, I will get it. Who was it? The postman. Guess what came in the mail? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Again, one more time. You were using will. Yes. Here we're using will. And one more time, we have this combination of tenses, which is pretty much very good if you notice here. Right? So we combine the tenses here. And again, it's like uh, as Patricia was mentioning, it's like here with like uh, make taking a decision, right? Sure, I get it, right? As you may know, we use the future with will also when we offer help. At the instant, we're having a conversation. Oh, I will help you. No problem. And come dialogue number uh, four. This is a little bit long. Okay. Dialogue number four. We have a phone conversation in here. Okay, we have Paul and Tara. Uh, Patricia Castellanos, you are going to be Tara. And mm, mm, what is Sandra Rivas? You are going to be Paul. Okay, Sandra. Ready? Let's begin. Hello, this is Paul. Can I speak to Wayne? Okay. Mm. I am Paul. Yes, you're Paul. Sandra. Paul. Hello, this is Paul. Can I speak to Gwen? Wayne? Wayne. Patricia Castellanos, excuse me. Yes, sorry, teacher. Oh. Hello, Paul. This is Tara. When it's out uh, for lunch, do you want to leave a message? Mm, let's see. Will she be back by 2 p.m.? Uh, no, she won't be back until 4. She says she will do something, some shopping after lunch. I see. Can you tell her to call me later? Sure, I will let her know that you called. Thank you so much. That was very nice, okay? Also, when we have a conversation, right, in, in a phone, like on a phone, we use the future, okay? Like, okay, I let her know. I'll take a message for you, okay? Yes. And will she be back by 2 p.m.? We use the future with will. So that's why the first thing that like we try to teach you is the future with will because that's the one that we use the most. Then we're gonna use the future with going. Okay. So uh but at the end, don't forget that it depends on the way you communicate or the message that you want to share. 
right? So uh, that is the key, right? That is the key. Because it's like you want to communicate something planned, you go with future with going. To. If you want to communicate like an instant decision or a probability, so you go with uh, will. Yes. So um, that is a difficult part sometimes because, uh, well, we forget. We tend to forget uh, that that is that grammar is not true, uh, and and that's when we like um, we don't communicate the, the correct ideas. Okay, with the correct grammar tense. Any question about it? Um, no. Okie dokie. I have a, quite another activity for you that I would like to share, which is the following. Just give me a minute. Um, here we go. We're going to have this short uh, reading. Well, it's an email, right? As you may see on the screen, we have Josh writing this thing. Uh, Roxanne Elizabeth Diaz, please do me a favor and read this email. Thank okay. you so much. Dear Joss, I'm very happy you are going to Los Palos with you for this for the weekend. We'll probably leave at around 6 p.m. on Friday. The trip will be uh, about six hours. So I guess we'll stop for dinner on the way. We are going to rent a small cottage outside Los Palos. It's very cold in this time of the year so you better bring some warm cloth and you yeah. should bring some good books too los palos is very quick so there's not very much to do see you on friday kate thank you so much okay we have a quiet place yeah. oh there are two movies about a quiet place right there yeah. are two movies a quiet place Okay, um, yeah, so we have this email. And here we have some um, activities, let's say. Here we have some plans, possible plans, and advice. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, what is, give me a minute, because I'm looking for one of your classmates. Uh, but I don't remember her name. Um, she's not here. Tell me, hello, tell me, tell me, good evening. Tell me, hi, teacher. Thank you. Tell me, read this, uh, these things, please, these activities. Tell me, can you participate? Can you participate, Delmi? Yes. Uh, please, please, Delmi, read these uh, activities. This one's here. Oh, let me check the chat. No. Oh, oh, that means that you cannot participate, right? So you can't. Thank you. Uh, heaven. Thank you, Heaven. Please. Thank you. Okay. Go to Los Palos. Uh, plans. Live, uh, live at uh, six. Uh, oh, three. A stop for dinner. Mm -hmm. Rent yes. a cottage. Brian wear clothes. Very good. Brian good, good books. Brian good books. Okay. Brain, good books. Thank you. Um, okay. Very good. Thank you. So we're going to identify which ones are plans, which ones are possible plans, and which ones are, say, advice. Okay? So let's yes. begin. Number one is already done. What about number two? Live at six. What is that? Any plans. Plans. Possible plans. Possible? Possible plans. Exactly. Possible plans. Possible. Possible. Exactly. Possible. What about the number three? So for dinner. It's the plans. It's the plans. It's plans. plans. I just thought for plans. dinner. Oh, that's principle, right? That's one of the key things. Right? Rent a cottage. Rent a, a cottage. Plans. Plans. Huh? It's plans. Plans. Okay, very good. Plans. What about brain warm clothes? Warm clothes. It's a vice. It's a vice. 
Advice. 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 And number six. Is to. Is advice. advice. It's the same. Advice. Okay. Advice. So if you see here, right, we have this email, which is pretty much about going somewhere. Yes. Right. Los Palos. My gosh. What is what is Los Palos? Okay, let me check. Maybe. Teacher. Yes. Why the number three is not a possible plan? Yes. Because in the image, it text, California. I guess. I guess. So, we'll so I guess we'll stop for sounds... dinner on the way. Yes. It sounds California. It's a possible plan. Okay. Yeah. So that's a possible plan. Number three, yes. right? Yes. Perfect. Thank you so much. Yes. So we have two, two and two, right? Okay. Thank you so much for sharing that. That's right. Place. Oh my gosh, I don't find it. Los Palos. Oh, that is in Palo Alto, California. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Los Palos, this, this, like, this thing, this place is not. Yeah. Yeah, it's a Palo Alto, California. I told you. That's, like, far, far away, right? Yeah. <laughs> like, uh, correct. Mm -hmm. um, parents, you know. Yeah, that's far, far away. Okay, give me a lost. minute. Give me a minute because I need to take the attendance really quick. When you take your beautiful name, say, please, and or I'm here. Alvaro Camilo. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Nice to have you. Anna Beatriz Martinez. Thanks. Hello, teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Uh, Cesar Aparicio. Present teacher. Thank you, Cesar. Nice to have you. Uh, Darwin Blanco. No, he isn't. Delmi Amaya. Uh, present teacher. Thank you, Delmi. Nice to have you one more time. Emilio Efraín. Oh, sorry, Efrain Emilio. That's your name. My apologies. No, he isn't. I will check the chat on the soon when I finish taking the attendance. Okay, so don't worry. Just write it over there if you're here. Uh, Sarai, you're here, right? Thank you so much. Franklin Magaña. Hello, Franklin. Present. Thank you, Sarai. Geraldine. Present, teacher. Thank you so much for being here. Heaven. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. Nice to have you. Ingrid Flores. Hello, Ingrid. No, she isn't. Irma Segura. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Nice to have you. Jesus Eduardo Escobar. No, she isn't. What about... Jose Vaquerano Sanchez. Jose Vaquerano. Present set. The chat. Juan David Madrid. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Nice to have you. Catherine Rivera. Hello, Catherine. No, she isn't. Uh, Kevin Flores. Okay, it's Lucia Elena. You're here, right? Lucia? Yeah. Hello, Lucia. What about Melvin Diaz? Melvin? No? Here. Daniela Carranza. Hello. Thank you, Daniela. Nice to have you one more time. Milagro de la Paz. Here right. I am, sir. I'm here. I saw you. Thank you so much. Mirna Landos. Hello, Mirna Landos. Are you here? Okay. Nelson. Teron. Nelson. Nelson? Okay, okay. Thank you, Geraldine. That's very nice of you. Thank you. 
um, Patricia García. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Nice to have you. Patricia Castellanos. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. Uh, Ronald Alexis Martinez. Here, teacher. Thank you, gentlemen. Nice to have you. Roxana Diaz. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. And Sandra Asensio, right? Thank you, and Sandra Rivas. I'm here, present. Thank you so much. Give me a minute while I check the chat on Zoom really quick. Okay, Nelson, very good, Nelson. Okay, just give me a minute. Okay, okay. Yeah. Good. Oh, here we go, here we go. Uh, let me check also. Jose Alejandro. Let me check something really quick here. Jose. Okay, Jose Alejandro. Um, okay, very good. Thank you. Uh, let me check somebody else. Uh, Nelson and Melvin. Okay, Nelson. Melvin, thank you, Melvin. And also Nelson, right? Okay, very good. Let me check that one really quick. Oh. Um, Emilio, Emilio. Okay, Emilio, ahorita, let me check. Give me a minute. Gosh. Yes, it's done already. Yep. Very good, Nelson. And Okay, very good. I got you all here. Thank you so much for uh, letting me know. We're going to have uh, some questions about your personal information. Okay. About your personal information that I want you to do is answer this question. We have five questions. Okay. Um, and you are going to answer those questions. <laughs> for <three. laughs> <laughs> I, love, I love you, Jester, right? I love you. Yeah. <laughs> that was very, that was very good. Okay. <laughs> I love, I love that. Okay, so you are going to answer this question like this one. I'm going to spend my next vacation. You are going to answer with one, going to, and you are going to give me one, with future, with will. So you can say the expression, I'm not sure. Yes. How are you going to spend your next vacation? Where are you going to go? What are you going to tell your vacation? Sorry, how, where are you going going to take vacation? How? how long are you going to take are going to be on vacation? And is anyone going to travel with you? Yes. So write these questions in your beautiful notebook, yes? And I need you to answer these questions with your personal information. I will give you, I will give you 10 minutes to do this one, to, to write this, the questions and to answer the question. And after this, we will get into the breaker room so you can ask and answer these questions to your partners, okay? Yep. We're, going, we're only gonna cop, copy one, one question. No, the oh, five. All of them. Yeah, all of them. Five. All of them. All and of you them. Answer the five as well. Yes. Okay. Uh, Juan David, do you understand? Yep. Yes, yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. If you have a question, I'm here. Oh, Kevin. Okay, Kevin. Right now. Thank you so much. Also, uh, Juan uh, David, uh, your comment like uh, comes to my mind. The comment you made about like uh, the conversation we <laughs> yes is 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 uh, in the conversation uh, ordinary day is uh, is is possible because because when you answer this question you will get in the break room with your classmate okay so you can have your conversation with them oh, oh, um. where are you going to go. <laughs> that was very good. Okay. Yeah. If, if somebody if somebody does not understand this one, 
Let me know. Yeah, you to take your vacation. Okay. Yes. Patricia is, is very happy because she's writing, right, Patricia? Yes, you love writing. Yes. She has a diary, like, and she writes every day something about her life. Uh, <laughs> I, was, I was reading a diary from a, it was like a, like an eight, eight years old girl, and that was a really nice diary. Yeah. I, I love I love the way children write. How long are you going stuff, to you know? The, the way they do they are very honest when they write. Okay. So uh that's that's very nice. It's it's nice to read a stuff from I don't know, like a like a eight or seven years old. Uh yeah, that's a very a very nice opinion for them. Yeah, I enjoy it. I enjoy it. Yes. So um if you have any question or if you do not understand what are you going to do, let me know. Okay? We're going to write these five questions in your notebook and, and answer. Then we're going to get into the record. So you can ask and answer these questions with all your points. Oh, please don't leave. Don't leave. Okay. Just, I just don't go. <laughs> Stay here. Stay here. Oh, what happened? Oh, okay. It's not raining today. That's rare. Okay, I miss the rain. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very like extremely hot. Extremely hot. Yes. Uh, uh, like um, it is winter, right? And, yes. I, and I'm thinking about I'm thinking about summer. Like <laughs> that will be heavy. That will yeah. be. Heavy. Okay. Um, Sandra Asensio, everything good? Yes. Well, how, uh, can you explain me what we're gonna use to answer oh, the questions? Yes, you can use going to uh, to like communicate your uh, future events, or you can use uh, future with will. So don't forget when you use the future with will, I need you to use the phrases, so um, so you can get a little bit of practice on. Yeah. Also, if you're ready, let me know. Okay. Let me know. Or if you haven't finished, well, also let me know. Yes. Is anyone going to travel with you? Oh, that's a good one. That's a good question. Yes, yeah, so uh, write them down and then answer the question. Are you ready, Patricia uh, Garcia? Are you ready? <laughs> yes, I invent. I invent. Yes, yes, exactly. Right. Just, just uh, don't worry about it. Just, just try to answer the questions the best. The best no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you know, writing is one of the best things uh, when it comes to learn English. I love it. I love it because it's, it helps us a lot. And it's very difficult, not easy. Like, like maybe we can write, like, or, or type a computer. But here, with, when it comes to writing, I love it because, like, um, like it's hard for us to, to do so. So, um, and, and, but it helps a lot. It helps a lot. Um, try to answer the questions the best way you can and, and and if you have a question about something that you do not understand let me know but also don't forget that you can use going to or will depending on the way you want to communicate the message right yes. if you use will yes. don't forget to use the expressions like i'm not sure i don't know um probably right and stuff like that
Thank you. So we just got two more minutes and then I will open the breaker room so you can join and uh, yeah. practice and practice with your partner. Remember, like uh, the idea with this one is that you can help your classmates, right? Uh, with pronunciation and also they can have confidence when they speak on this. One, right? And that, that confidence is, is very hard, hard to achieve because sometimes we are afraid. Uh, and as far as I know, uh, something that I really love from you is that like all of you try to speak, right? No matter what, you do it. And that's that's fantastic mm -hmm. from you. So uh, keep, keep working yeah. like that because that's the way we learn, right? You got to do it, right? Because sometimes I get sick of speaking, right? Like I'm just, it's just me speaking and I want you to, I want you to produce, you know what I mean? I want want to hear from you the information okay so i will open the breakout rooms uh, i will open the breakout rooms with three students in case somebody is having problems or somebody is working right as you may know uh this is uh, life and we have to pay bills yes so uh we gotta work we gotta work right so i'm gonna open the breakout rooms just give me a minute and I will give you some time. Okay, minutes. Okay, here we go. Two. Fits perfectly. Okay. Let me see how much time. Yes, there we go. Okay, tell me, Nelson and Patricia, you stay in the main room. So don't get into your breakout, <laughs> Patricia. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, Delmi and Nelson, no, no, you sleep. You stay in the main room, okay? Nelson and Patricia, and Delmi also stay in the main room. Patricia and Nelson. Okay, so Nelson and Patricia and Delmi, you stay here in the main room. In the Salon Principal, ustedes three, right? And practice here. Uh, Camilo, you need to join. Dele aceptar a la invitation, Camilo. Please. En la pantalla le va a aparecer. Yes? I raise it. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> lo voy a mover de un grupo y luego lo paso a otro. Yes? Okay. Perfect, perfect. Okay, so Delmi, Nelson, Patricia, this is space is for you so you can practice. Yes. Mm -hmm. Nelson, parece que usted me dijo que no podía participar, right? Que, que parece que está trabajando. Yes. Me avisa, me avisa si me equivoco. Okay. Oh, Nelson sí está trabajando. Very good. Y Delmi, hello Delmi. Hi, teacher. Puede participar with Patricia, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Yes. Hágale, hágale las preguntas a ella y luego, pues, ella le va a contestar y luego usted do the same. Yes? Yes. Perfect. Tell me. Hello. Ah, uh, solo que no tengo la captura. Oh, okay. Don't worry. I have it here. Yes. Well, gracias. I said, how are you got to spend your need vacation? <laughs> I probably, I will to go to each and meet with my family. Uh, where are you good uh, to go? Um, <laughs> maybe I will go to Puerto de la Libertad um, to eat minuta. Minuta, what do you say minuta? Minuta, minuta right? Minuto. 
Tell me, when are you going? Uh, we are you going to talk your vacation? Um, <laughs> um, I am going to be on vacation in Tochitoto place. No, no, no. This is when, Patricia. Okay. When. Ah, when. Yes. I'm sorry. Um, the next. I have to stop. Um, I am going to be. I am going to be on vacation in this in December. <laughs> Tell me, number four. Uh, how long are you going to be on vacation? And I am going to be on vacation in December with my. Oh, in no, it's, it's, on December. It's how long? How long? How long? How long? Like for two weeks, How for long? four days, for a month. Uh, <laughs> in my case, I am going to two days. <laughs> okay. okay, thank you. Thank you. And number five, tell me. Is I learn um um let's go and to me. trip. Tell me, I'm sorry, is anyone? Anyone? In a, uh, is a anyone go to trade with you? Okay. Um, I am going to travel with my husband, my daughter, and my mom. Oh, that's very good. So you're going to have your mom with you. Oh, that's very nice. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Tell me, se fijó como las contestó, contestó Patricia? Yes? Uh, yes. Ok, bueno, así las va a intentar contestar usted, ¿vale? Right? ¿Cuántas ha hecho? How many you have? Five. Eh, eh, no, sorry, with Delmi, with Delmi, with, with, I'm sorry, I'm with, sorry. Uh, with Delmi. Delmi, ¿cuántas escribió usted y cuántas contestó? Tell me. Mm. Five. Five. Es que yo soy, es, bueno, es que por el momento estaba cenando y no le puse mucha atención a la. Ok, no problema. No problem. Van a venir sus compañeros y le voy a hacer las mismas preguntas y usted pone atención cómo las contestar. ¿Sí? Yes? Ok. Ok. So you can write it down. Ok. Yes. Um, um, Delmi. Hi. Eh, en, 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 en YouTube hay un canal que se llama Aprendiendo Inglés con Alema. Sí, sí lo recomiendo para que revise otra vez el contenido. ¿Vale? ¿Yes? Bueno. Perfecto. Thank you so much. Very good. Nice job. I'm going to wait for your classmates so they can join us. Let me see the breakout rooms really quick. Yes, they're here. They're here. Thank you so much, Patricia. That was very good. Okay, great job. Okay. Great job. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay. Started from the bottom. Now we're here. Thank you so much, people, for being here. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. You did it right, Camilo. Yes. <laughs> I still get a little bit nervous, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, Sandra, Riva. Oh, I love, I love your background. I love it. Yes, that's fantastic. Look at that one. Yeah, that's good. Okay, thank you, teacher. Like the stars. Oh, look at that one. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, let's pick random people from here. Okay. Let's begin with you, Milagro de la Paz. Okay, and Sarai. Sarai. Yes, please. sir. Five questions. And then, Milagro, you ask her back. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay. Okay, Milagro. How are you going to spend your next vacation? Um, well, um, I'm going to spend my vacation, my next vacation, just 
standing at, at home and doing a household chore, mm -hmm. um, watching movies, oh, uh, reading books, um, nothing important, in fact. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, uh, where are you going to go? Uh, uh, I'm not sure. I would like to, to go to the beach and go to a new place, enjoy the nature. Okay. When are you going to take your vacation? I'm going to take my vacation next year in July. Okay. And how long are you going to be on, on vacation? Fifteen days. Days. Yeah, fifteen days. Is anyone going to travel with you? Oh no. Um, almost always I I travel alone, but maybe my my mom mm -hmm, is a, okay. Going to go with me. Yeah. That's nice. Uh -huh. What about you? How are you going to spend your next next vacation? Um, I'm going to spend my next vacation at the beach, or I'm not sure. I will stay at home. Probably I will stay at home. Um. Okay. Um. Where are you going to go? Which beach do you like to to visit? Mm, I'm. The, I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm just invented my answer. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably I'm going to stay at home. Ah, okay. And when are you going to take your vacation? Um, I guess. No, where, right? When? 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 I mm. guess I will take my vacation on December. On December, okay. And how long are you going to be on vacation? I'm going to be on vacation about two weeks. Two weeks, on December. Okay. Is anyone going to travel with you if you travel? Um, I think my sister will go with me. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. Very good. Great job, the two of you. Uh, a few things with, for example, Asarae, when we have the month, we said in December, like in November, okay? We use on, okay. we use on when we have in December 10. In that one, yes, we use on because we have a number after the month, okay? Okay, and teacher. If we have a period of time, we can say for two weeks, for one week, for two days. Yep, very good gonna have really quick Camilo and Alexis thank you uh Camilo please ask to Alexis the first three questions and then you uh, Alexis ask back Camilo the four and five questions okay okay, okay. how are you going how are how are you going to spend your next vacation I'm not sure maybe I'll I travel to Guatemala no. Where are you going to go? I want to. I'm going to visit a zoo, and I'm going to visit a uh, Esquipulas town. When are you going to take your vacations? Probably, I take my vacation in December this year. Okay. Okay. It's my turn. Uh, uh, yes, how no, long no. are you going? The the last two questions, teacher. Yes, four and five. Okay. How long are you going to be on vacation, Camilo? I think it will be one week at least. Is anyone going to travel with you? I think I'm going by myself. Okay. That's <laughs> better. <laughs> That's better, right? So, so you, so you enjoy that. I don't want to spend too much money, man. <laughs> so, that's a that's a huge that's a huge risk. 
that's good. So why everybody told me that I'm selfish? <laughs> Are you stingy? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe <laughs> no. no that's, that's, nice. that's good. Thank you so much for sharing. Okay, thank you so much for sharing. Good night, and we will see you tomorrow. Okay, don't forget tomorrow we have classes. Thank, thank you, teacher. Bye bye. Good night, everybody. Thank God bless. Bye, everybody. Thank you. So thank much. you. Goodbye, everyone. Have thank you. Have a good night.